Today's video is a kind of response video, if you like, to Keith's last video. Uh, you'll get what I mean. Roll the intro. Hi, it's me, Marcus. Welcome to another edition of Top Beer on a Tuesday night. It's the start of Advent, the start of Christmas almost, the Christmas festivities anyway. And uh, tonight I've been kindly given a beer by my good friend Keith, who some of you might know. And uh, he reviewed it on his last video. It's Shepherd Nim's. Christmas ale. He wanted to know what I thought of it. And I said, well, give me a bottle and I'll gladly tell you. <laughs> so, yeah, so he very kindly did. And uh, it is a really nice, nice looking bottle. Let me have a hold it so you can see it properly. There we are. Look. Yeah. And... Uh, yeah, it's this uh, shepherd name. It's got uh, like a, a, a Christmas wreath on it. A Christmas ale, Faversham Brewery, it says. A gold medal winner. How strong is it? 7%. Wow. Um, yeah, I have, I have watched his video in actual fact, um, but I've forgotten it was 7%. Um, a glowing amber winter ale with a heady fruity nose. Crystallised winter fruits combined with festive spices, hops in a platform uh, of smooth warming alcoholic notes, leaving a refreshing cleansing hop finish. All that room on the uh, label and that nice important bit. It's so small, look. Get rid of some of this foreign bump for which you, you know, we don't need over here. Make that a little bit bigger. <laughs> well, let's open it and see what's what. Uh. Right, here we go. Oh, I've just let the lid fall on the floor. I don't know if it had anything on there anyway. So, anyway. No, oh, now I'm getting a nice traditional beer coming through. Now, I am having this at oh, probably a little bit less than room temperature, this is. It's been it's stored cool, but not cold. Because it's a, a winter ale and I wanted to get the full flavours of it. Lovely, like I say, traditional ale and I'm getting the slightly fruity notes. Not really getting any spices coming through if, I, if I'm honest you know like cinnamon or anything like that it sounds nice and fruity hmm right a Christmas glass it's the most wonderful time for a beer it certainly is right <laughs> let's uh, pour this I'll see if I can do a better job than Keith did on Friday That's not too bad, is it? There you go. Nice amber ale. 
It is quite a deep amber, almost like a ruby beer. Very, very sort of, um, yeah, like a dark amber, slightly reddish. Like I say, it's almost a ruby. But um, but yeah, I would say definitely an um, definitely, definitely an amber. It's not a pale ale, right? Oh, now I'm getting a bit more of a sort of citrusy smell off of it. Slight, oh yeah, slight sort of brandy. Right, cheers. Wow, there's a lot going on there. There is, I don't know. <laughs> it's slightly confusing, really. Um, oh. Yes, definitely got a warming sort of flavour to it. It's got spiciness on the finish. It is fruity. I've had fruitier beers. It's quite a well balanced one actually. It is quite, it does taste quite strong. It's like, It's got a hint of Christmas cake, maybe a sort of hint of like mince pies, maybe a little bit, but I'm definitely getting satsumas coming through. It's quite sort of nutty and definitely got a sense of like um whiskey or brandy brandy I think and like I said there is a slight slight fruitiness there but it's not it's not over fruity and it's not sweet it's I don't think it is it's quite quite bitter a bitter sort of fruity flavor if you like but it's it's nice hmm it's nice it's not bad certainly a good one to start the Christmas festivities off with um not as fruity as i was expecting i was hoping for a little bit more it's not quite as christmassy as i was expecting if i'm honest it's like a um a strong shepherd name beer i suppose but that's not to say it's not a good beer. It is. It's, it's very nice, but it's not quite as Christmassy as uh, as I was expecting. Um, so with that, I'm gonna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna seem like a, a harsh, but I'm gonna give it a seven out of ten, which is still pretty respectable, to be fair. 
seven out of ten is a good drinkable beer, isn't it? It's um, it's pretty, you know, it's respectable. But I'm going to give it a seven out of ten. So, yeah, Shepherd Name Christmas Ale, seven out of ten. Subscribe if you like the channel, the videos. Uh, if you don't, then well, go elsewhere. Don't watch anymore. Um. <laughs> Because we're not changing, this is how it is. And, uh, you know, if you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. But uh, I think I've waffled on enough with this and uh, it's time to say goodbye. Until next time, do take care. And I'll see you next Tuesday. Cheers.